Although humanity has yet to venture beyond Earth with a manned mission, we've already made remarkable strides in unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos. The universe encompasses everything, from vast galaxies to the fabric of space-time and the essence of life itself. But much of what we believe to be true is still built on theories and speculation. That's where space missions like Voyager 1 prove to be invaluable. Voyager 1 and similar probes provide crucial data, helping us move beyond guesses and deepen our knowledge of the universe. This spacecraft has enabled us to explore the far edges of our solar system, taking us closer to the unknown than ever before. But what happens when a probe that has long been reliable starts sending back strange, even unsettling signals? According to NASA Administrator Bill Nelson, Voyager 1 recently made contact with mysterious extraterrestrial forces. Scientists have been both shocked and puzzled by the disturbing signals Voyager 1 has transmitted. But what do these signals mean? And how might they affect Voyager's next steps? Space is a vast, delicate system where everything must work in harmony. Read on to uncover more about these alarming signs. Launched from Cape Canaveral 45 years ago, the Voyager probes set off on a mission that has become one of the greatest adventures in space exploration. Both spacecraft have now traveled beyond the outer edges of our solar system. Along the way, they've revolutionized science and sent home breathtaking images. Since the late 1970s, Voyager 1 and 2 have been key to expanding our understanding of the giant planets. These spacecraft were designed with extraordinary care to withstand the intense radiation near massive planets like Jupiter and Saturn. Against all odds, the Voyagers have endured the harsh conditions of deep space, equipped with heat shields, layers of insulation, and protective coatings. They've braved bitter cold, powerful radiation, and fine dust. This ambitious mission represents about 11,000 man-years of effort, reflecting the dedication of thousands of people. Originally, the probes aimed to explore Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. They've sent back astonishing photos and revealed secrets of these distant worlds. From the iconic pale blue dot image of Earth to the discovery of Io's volcanic eruptions, the Voyagers have captured sites that continue to inspire wonder. While not the first probes to journey this far, Voyager 1 and 2 were built specifically to venture deeper into space, building on what missions like Pioneer 10 had begun. Every part of these probes was engineered to endure the dangers of deep space and keep their instruments working. Voyager 1 was equipped to continue operating beyond the boundaries of the solar system with sophisticated tools and communications gear. Among its most notable features is the 12-foot high-gain antenna, which allows it to transmit signals across unimaginable distances to NASA's Deep Space Network. With stations in the US, Spain, and Australia, this global network ensures that Voyager 1 signals can be received no matter how the Earth is positioned. Voyager 1 also carries a digital recorder that stores up to 67 gigabytes of data. So if the probe can't immediately transmit, nothing is lost. The data is sent once a connection is restored, preserving valuable information even during brief periods of silence. Voyager 1's internal systems were designed with space's unpredictability in mind. Its thrusters, gyroscopes, and reference sensors work together to keep the antenna locked onto Earth. This alignment is critical because the outer solar system is filled with fast-moving particles that could easily push the probe off course. These systems let Voyager adjust as needed to stay in touch. Powering these systems is another marvel of engineering. Unlike earlier missions that depended on solar panels, Voyager 1 draws energy from three radioisotope thermoelectric generators. These RTGs contain plutonium-238, which gradually decays and generates heat, turned into electricity. This allows the spacecraft to function even in the darkest reaches of the solar system where sunlight can't reach. Because of these RTGs, Voyager 1 has been able to travel beyond the solar system's edge, relying on this steady energy source. After its 1977 launch, it passed Mars's orbit 
and set its sights on mighty Jupiter. Voyager 1 reached Jupiter in March 1979, beginning a detailed survey of the planet and its moons. It captured high-resolution images and gathered critical data on Jupiter's magnetic field, ring system, and radiation belt. It even flew within about 217,000 miles of the planet's center, offering views never seen before, such as the first close-ups of the Great Red Spot. This massive storm, larger than Earth itself, was only one of the many discoveries. Voyager 1 also spotted active volcanoes on Io, marking the first time eruptions had been observed beyond our planet. Later, in November 1980, Voyager 1 achieved another first, becoming the initial spacecraft to fly past Saturn, revealing its complex rings and dynamic atmosphere up close. The probe recorded Saturn's fierce winds, clocked at 1,100 miles per hour, faster than any measured before. Its observations of Saturn's moons, including Titan, Hyperion, and Enceladus, provided new insights into these intriguing worlds. Voyager's encounter with Titan was especially significant, offering a rare look at a thick atmosphere and hinting at liquid hydrocarbon lakes that might form clouds on the moon. Voyager 1's instruments transmitted crucial data about Titan's atmosphere, helping scientists piece together its composition. As the mission continued toward the edges of the solar system, NASA carefully shut down non-essential systems to conserve power, including the spacecraft's cameras. But before they went dark, Voyager 1 captured the famous family portrait of the solar system, with Earth appearing as a fragile speck, the pale blue dot. Taken in 1990, this image portrays our planet as less than a pixel in size, emphasizing its smallness in the grand universe. It reminds us of our shared home and the unity of all life. The pale blue dot became a symbol of our place in the cosmos and the importance of continuing to explore and learn. Even without cameras, Voyager 1 has kept sending data as it journeys deeper into interstellar space. Its instruments recorded surprising information at the solar system's boundary, including a magnetic field at the heliopause far stronger than expected and a region of plasma shielding the solar system from harmful cosmic rays. Scientists are still working to understand these features and their role in protecting us and in shaping future deep space missions. Some researchers propose that the heliosphere, once thought to resemble a comet's tail, might actually be shaped more like a croissant or donut, with gaps that could allow safer passage for future explorers. These ideas fuel our drive to better map and comprehend our solar system's edge. Voyager 1's incredible journey has changed how we see the universe and continues to inspire humanity's quest to unlock the secrets of the stars. This discovery plays a crucial role in deepening our understanding of the boundary that marks the edge of our solar system and the vast unknown of interstellar space. The heliosphere's magnetic field appears to interact directly with the larger cosmic environment, pointing to an active relationship between our solar system and the distant universe. Thanks to this breakthrough, scientists now have fresh questions to explore and new research paths to follow as they try to unravel the complexities of this transitional region. When Voyager 1 officially crossed into interstellar space in 2012, it marked a groundbreaking achievement for humanity's exploration efforts. Since then, every transmission from the probe has been eagerly awaited, offering potential glimpses into the realm beyond the heliosphere that were once unimaginable. However, during a recent data collection phase, Voyager 1 began transmitting strange and unexpected signals that defied established scientific models. The unusual nature of these readings has captured the attention of NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory leaving experts puzzled. These signals describe conditions in interstellar space that should not exist, and scientists now face the challenge of interpreting these mysterious messages. Determined to uncover the truth, researchers are working tirelessly to decode Voyager 1's data in hopes of revealing more about the vast expanse that surrounds us. As experts attempt to make sense of this curious data, a new mystery has come to light. The source of these strange signals appears to be Voyager 1's attitude articulation and control system, AACS, 
which is responsible for keeping the probe's antenna pointed correctly to maintain communication. What makes this situation more baffling is that while the AACS seems to be functioning as expected and the probe continues to collect valuable information, the data it sends back includes nonsensical readings. After careful analysis, mission engineers identified the root cause. Voyager 1's AACS had inadvertently begun routing data through a faulty computer system that had been out of use for years. Although the scientific data gathered by the probe remained accurate, this detour through the malfunctioning computer led to corrupted signals being sent back to Earth. Once the issue was clear, NASA acted quickly by instructing Voyager 1 to bypass the compromised computer and transmit data through its functional systems. This adjustment resolved the problem, and reliable data about the probe's interstellar environment started streaming in again. As Voyager 1 presses on with its mission, it continues to provide essential insights into the mysteries of deep space. While mission controllers are confident this was a one-time error, the event has underscored the challenges and uncertainties that come with exploring the outer reaches of the solar system and the need for continued vigilance. Voyager 2, which entered interstellar space in 2018, may face similar hurdles as it journeys farther from home. Although both probes were designed to operate for just five years, they far outlasted their original lifespan, with more than 45 years of continuous service. This remarkable longevity is a testament to the resilience of their design and the ingenuity of the engineers who built them. Despite their age, mission planners are hopeful that both Voyager spacecraft will remain operational into 2025. Voyager 1, in particular, is expected to keep sending back valuable data for another few years before its power supply is finally exhausted. In roughly 300 years, Voyager 1 will enter the Oort Cloud, a distant region filled with icy objects that marks the edge of the solar system. And it may take about 30,000 years for the probe to pass all the way through this vast field. In an even more astonishing future, Voyager 1 is projected to come closer to the star Gliese 445, located 17.6 light years from Earth, than to our own Sun, some 40,000 years from now. Around the same time, Voyager 2 will pass within 1.7 light years of the red dwarf Ross 248, situated in the Andromeda constellation. As these two pioneers continue their endless voyage through the galaxy, they will bear silent witness to the slow evolution of the Milky Way. Over the next 230 million years, our solar system will complete one orbit around the galactic center, and by then our galaxy's graceful spiral arms may have been reshaped or disrupted by its anticipated collision with Andromeda. One of the most fascinating elements of Voyager 1's journey is the golden record it carries, a time capsule containing greetings in dozens of languages, sounds from nature, and music from cultures around the globe. If Voyager 1 were ever to encounter intelligent life, this record would provide a rare window into the diversity and richness of life on Earth. The Voyager missions stand as enduring symbols of human curiosity and our drive to uncover the secrets of the universe. These trailblazing spacecraft have forever changed how we see the cosmos, offering discoveries that continue to spark wonder and inspire future generations of explorers. Thank you for joining us for this look at Voyager's ongoing mission. To see more incredible space stories, check out the next video on your screen. The Voyager probes remind us of the incredible power of human ingenuity and ambition. Launched in 1977, these spacecraft were designed primarily to study the giant planets of our solar system, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. What began as a planetary mission soon evolved into humanity's first foray into interstellar space, a bold journey beyond anything imagined at the time of their creation. With each mile they travel, they push the boundaries of our knowledge and our imagination, venturing into a cosmic ocean that remains largely uncharted. It's humbling to consider that the Voyagers are now farther from Earth than any human-made object has ever been. At such distances, it takes over 22 hours for a single radio signal 
to reach Voyager 1, and just as long for its reply to return. Yet despite the vast gulf of space between us and these robotic pioneers, their faint signals continue to link us to the distant edge of our solar neighborhood. Every bit of data they send offers a precious glimpse into regions we may never visit ourselves. A reminder of our desire to explore, even in the face of daunting challenges. The unexpected technical issues Voyager 1 encountered have also served as a stark reminder of the harshness and unpredictability of space. Out there, far beyond the protective bubble of the heliosphere, conditions are unlike anything we experience on Earth. Radiation, micrometeoroid impacts, and the sheer age of the spacecraft pose constant threats. Yet, the team at NASA continues to overcome these obstacles, showing remarkable creativity and problem-solving skills honed over decades of mission operations. In addition to their scientific achievements, the Voyager spacecraft have taken on profound symbolic meaning. They represent humanity's message in a bottle cast into the cosmic sea. The golden records they carry aren't just scientific instruments. They're artifacts of culture, music, language, and hope. Carved onto these disks are the sounds of Earth, a baby crying, the roar of the surf, greetings in 55 languages, and music from across our world, from Bach and Beethoven to traditional melodies of faraway lands. Should another intelligent species one day find Voyager, it will encounter a snapshot of who we were at the time of the launch, a message meant to bridge the gap between civilizations across the stars. Looking to the future, scientists and engineers continue to learn valuable lessons from the Voyager missions. The insights gained from managing spacecraft at extreme distances inform the design of future deep space probes, such as those that might one day explore the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn, visit exoplanets, or even attempt missions beyond the Oort cloud. As we set our sights on new frontiers, the Voyagers remain a source of inspiration and guidance. Long after their power supplies have faded and their instruments fallen silent, the Voyagers will continue their silent journey through the galaxy. For millions of years, these tiny emissaries of Earth will drift among the stars, perhaps outlasting even our own species. A lasting testament to a time when a small world reached out to touch the cosmos. And so, as we reflect on the ongoing mission of Voyager 1 and its twin, Voyager 2, we are reminded that exploration is at the heart of what it means to be human. These spacecraft, built with 1970s technology but fueled by timeless curiosity, continue to carry our dreams into the great unknown. Their discoveries will shape our understanding of the universe for generations to come and their legacy will echo across the ages as we strive to unlock the secrets of the stars.